Good afternoon and welcome to Snow Suzuki and Paul. My name is Matthew Beard, I'm the General Sales Manager and I want to talk to you today about the 2019 model year Suzuki Vitara. The car in front of us here is a SZ5 model, top of the range. This is in fact a 2018 model year car and the reason why I want to have a look at this is I've parked it against the new 2019 model year car. If I come round to the front here, you'll be able to see some of the differences. So the new car has got a revised front grille, much cleaner lines, also a revised front bumper uh, where the number plate is and just below the number plate, the little rectangle that you can see there is the car's front radar system. Also looking at the front bumper, we've got new chrome inserts around the daytime running lights compared to the old car which was just all plastic and colour coded. Moving up to the top of the windscreen here, we've got more cameras uh, which are relevant to the car's onboard safety systems which have now been improved. Let's bring you around so you can take a look at the side of the car. New designed and restyled uh, multi-face uh, 17 inch alloy wheels. We've still retained some of the good elements of the previous car the black trims that run around the outside of the wheel arches and also the black trim that runs along the sill so it won't uh, get marked up by stones and things flicking upwards. Let's bring you around to the back of the car where some of the biggest changes have been. So on the back of the car here we've got newly designed rear lights in comparison to the old car. So I guess the biggest difference is the reversing light, the clear light has now been moved down to the bottom of the rear bumper which means that we can have smoked rear lenses on the red lights at the back of the car. Also you'll be able to see that the actual light itself protrudes out a little bit further than the old car did. So these really will stand out on dark and dismal evenings for people who are following you behind. Again on the back of the car we've still got the car's reversing camera and also its remote central locking uh, door release. So let's open up the car and have a look inside. Beautiful half leather Alcantara trim now. It looks really sumptuous, it's really really comfortable. Let me hop inside and shut the door, it'll be a bit quieter. So new chrome trim that runs through the middle of the dashboard. We've still got the same touch sensitive infotainment system that the previous car had so uh, I can navigate this simply by pressing the relevant square and it will take me into the next menu or I can press the home button it will take me back to the beginning again so really really intuitive really really easy to use dual zone climate control system located down at the bottom here we've got a new digital multifunction con um, control panel on the binnacle here which is controlled by this switch on the side here so this can cycle through the different information that this car can tell us. Multi-function steering wheel so on this side over here we've got uh, audio controls over on this side here we've got uh, cruise control and our distance control for the cruise as well. Moving down a little bit further we've got uh, Bluetooth telephone switches and also our lane keeping assist switch here as well one of the safety systems on the car. If I just hop out again and go around to the front. As part of this car's onboard safety system it's also got lane keeping assist so if I just have a look at the mirror here you might be able to see this picture of two little cars. So this will illuminate if something is close up by the side of you if you're unable to see it. But I guess the biggest change of this car is the fact that it's got much more fuel efficient engines now which means lower emissions lower Rotex. This is our new demonstrator it's a 1.4 booster jet. To arrange your test drive or to take a closer look please give us a call or pop in and see us. We we'll look forward to hearing from you.